Good evening and welcome back once again. We've just come off the back of a win in the Club World Cup final, so another trophy on board. Unfortunately, Diaby did pick up a knock, as you can see. He's out for a week, so he's going to miss some crucial matches. Obviously this one, but the next match is against Real Madrid, so he's unfortunately going to miss that one. Today we're going in with Neuer in goal, Zirkov, Gvardiol, Kostinu and Trippier as the back four, Bellingham, Mariba and Fabio Vieira in the central roles, and we're going to have a front three of Zirksi, Mudrik and Pedri. Good to be back at home in the league. Now, we're four points ahead of Real Madrid. I'm assuming that they're probably going to win their match today. And hopefully we'll win ours as well. So we've got to assume that going into the next tie against Real Madrid, probably going to be uh, four points ahead of them. It's just a crucial match. As you can see, Xerxes is getting all the applause here. Now, the reason for that is he's just picked up... You get those traits in, like... Um, Bandera and Virtuoso and all of those things. If you've played the game, you know what they are. Um, he's actually just got superstar status um, and what that means is I, th I think he brings in more gate receipts and more money when he plays um, it mentions something about people not in his position are easier to sign and negotiation, negotiations are easier but if you try and sign someone in his position from another club it's harder which makes sense because they don't want to join the club, I suppose, because you've already got a superstar in that role. Um, and I think there was a couple of other benefits in there. I can't remember what they were. But I didn't realise you got a... Um, you got a little sort of... Uh, video of him looking around the crowd when that happens. Haven't seen that before. Should be back in the starting 11 as well. He was rested in the last game and uh, Joaquin played again. And here he is, <laughs> and the superstar, Zirksi, with a goal, at back at home, Trippier getting the assist, what a start that is, that was almost set up wasn't it, for that to happen, nice play, really nice ball in, keep it gets a hand of it, nice fist pump from Zirksi there as well, I don't know if I've seen that before, I might just imagining things. Must have seen that before. I've seen that celebration many times. Yeah, it's a shame about DRB. Like I say, it's only for a week, but again, we've been getting lots of tackles against our team. Like, really poor tackles. And apart from one that I remember getting called a free kick, the rest of them haven't been given. And tackles like that get given against me, which I'm sure I got the ball there. But ones where the, the AI are going absolutely flying in. Like two footed challenges. And maybe technically they get some of the ball. But they absolutely wipe out the play. And I'm picking up knocks every week or two. Nice tackle from Kosinu. And he's going to drive forward here. Plays it into Xerxi. He's got Pedri for support. Pedri oh, straight at the keeper. But it had some power on it. Barely kept a hold of it. And sorry if you can hear any noise in the background. My uh, neighbours, I think, playing a movie pretty loud. Not going to complain. Um, it's there. You know, they can do that if they want. I like playing a movie loud when I've got one on. But uh, yeah, apologies if you can hear any sort of weird rumbling. Zirksi showing his strength. One <laughs> gets a shot away. It's wide, but he looks like he's on form today. Win the ball back. Zirksi lost it, but he was fighting for it. That's what got us the ball back in the end. Pedri starting on the uh, the left wing position, which he doesn't normally. We're just playing him in there just to switch things around a bit and rest a few people. Obviously, Diaby being out as well. Mudrik's playing on the right. And, of course, we've got tired bodies from the Club World Cup too. Good tackle there. Six, he's in again. 
Pedri, Zirksi, Pedri again. Ah, oh, should have scored. Good save. Zirksi, oh, taken off his toe there. And Pedri too. Nice play. Zirksi. Mudrick, Zirksi again. And the keeper, well, he looked like some sort of salmon diving at the ball there, but um, <laughs> being a bit dramatic, I think. I think it was a decent save, but you didn't need to go flopping around like that. That's a phrase I didn't think I'd be saying today. Um, <sighs> gets blocked there. Chasing them down today, though. Really hard hassling them. Doesn't always work, but... Oh, get unlucky there. Good keeping, though. Got very unfortunate with that deflection. It goes right into his path, and the defence was carved open because of it. That would be an unfortunate goal. Oh, nice play there from Vieira to Mudrick. Needs some support, though. And here he is. Here's Trippier. Lovely ball. Oh, Cirksy went towards the ball. If he had just waited, it might have been right on his head. And again, hassling them. Cirksy's in here. Mudrick. Oh, good save. Not really going to beat the keeper there, or he shouldn't, but... There wasn't really any support. I thought might as well go for the shot. You never know. Oh. Couldn't quite get over the ball. Still just can't master those headers. Score the odd one. In fact, we scored two in... Uh, not. I think it was the first match in the Club World Cup. Two in one game. Yeah, one was off a corner and one was off a, a cross. You very rarely score them otherwise, though. Good tackle. Zixi's had a lot of the ball today. Zixi. Oh, just wide. The keeper was struggling there. It's an ambitious effort. And there. Uh, I think the keeper would have been a bit red-faced if he got caught out there. Fired into Mudrick. Nice play. Now Mariba, Pedri. Zirkov in support. Oh, it's over here. Yeah. That should just be half time, I think. There it is. 60 with an early goal, but still all to play for. So we dominated the half. I think we had eight shots on goal, five on target. Majority of the possession. But just the one goal. now Pedri blocked oh, that's a poor ball to Marie but that's not like Vieira at all lumped up forward Guardiola wins it a oh, really nice ball into Mariba. Mariba now Oh, look at the dip on that. Oh, I'd love that to have gone in. Let's have a quick look at this again. It's a lovely port by Pedri into Mariba's path. He can just... Doesn't even have to stop the stride. It's perfectly struck it. Unfortunately, it was just off target. Love to see those dipping shots. Sexy again. Now Pedri... 
He does well to get around the defender there. Zixi. And there it is. It's two. Another fist pump. Pedri with an assist this time. I thought the ball was poor for a second, but Pedri manages to get around the defender. Burst down the line. It's a really nice little ball. Maybe get a little bit of luck with that finish. Let's have a quick look. Does it clip the keeper? Nope. It goes underneath him almost. It's looking a little bit safer now. Maybe can relax a tiny bit. Certainly hasn't been our best performance. Just not quite at our fluent best. Trippier has them, but he couldn't quite win it. Good tackle there. Good teamwork. Six eight to Pedri. A nice ball to Bellingham. who has joined Real Madrid and I just just played in a friendly and I think he just scored his first goal. Um, obviously that would have been a couple of, probably quite a while back before. Oh, Pedri should have been concentrating on the football there. That'll probably be a, a few weeks ago for you by the time you see this video, but uh, yeah, he's going to be some player. Pedri, good save. He's already a great player, but joining Real Madrid, you never know, he might, whether he'll hold up in the... Uh, the headlights there but so we're going with a completely new midfield now Herrera coming on for Bellingham Fabio Vieira going off for Cousins and Mariba going off for Kangen Lee and we're going to switch Pedri back to his favorite attacking midfielder we'll put Kangen Lee on the right and Madrid on the left and this potentially could be Cousins' last performance now there are two matches before the January transfer when opens and his transfer his uh, permanent transfer going out will go through officially at that stage so he could get some more game time, but wanted to make sure that he gets, you know, a match at home, some time on the ball. There's Pedri. Pedri again. Oh, deflected. Nearest Cousins. He was been a great player. We've got him for free. And he's been a, such a good player for us. So he go, goes with uh, good wishes. Hope he does well at his new club. Good defending there. Showing strength. for Mudrick but he gets it back now Pedri into Mudrick oh great strike lovely pass great strike and a good save just good all round football there Pedri again no definitely feels like it should have been a game that's with more than two goals Oh, and there it is. And it's Cotonou. We do bring him up for the corners. And he doesn't often score, but he's got one. I think that might be his first this season. Really nice ball. And it's a volleyed finish. Somehow gets through the keeper and the defender. Just so much power on it. more like it be interesting to see at the end of the season how many assists Trippier ends up with because he does get a lot for us ok yeah he takes corners and free kicks but he doesn't get many off corners um, but he does support us a lot going up I 
And Zirkov does as well, but doesn't seem to get as many stats. Him and Baka. Trippier, I think in the first few games he played, he got about three or four assists. Pedri, good save. Herrera, oh, just over, hit the stanchion behind the goal, that was a thunderbolt, lovely strike. Nice play there, Zixi. Couldn't get through, lots of players behind the ball. Only a couple of minutes left. I want to keep that clean sheet, but can we get one more chance, maybe? Now yeah, it's offside from Ziggs. Yeah, I thought he was. I was trying to time it. Yeah, he just didn't hold his run. So that should be it. God, Ziggs, he's absolutely flat out on his feet, though. Hang on a minute. Oh, well, we do get that clean sheet in the end, but a double from Xerxi, the superstar, and Kasunu right towards the end there. And Xerxi get a man of the match, without doubt he was. Good game, not our off fluent best. 3-0 was probably about a fair result in the end. And as you can see on the right-hand side there, Real Madrid have kept up the pace, so they're still four points behind us. And it's a clash of the top two next at the Bernabeu, so please join us for that one. Hit that like button, drop a comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. And as always, I do appreciate your guys' support. I'll see you next time. Cheers.